It's funny how mood-changing food can be, and how equally important the where, the when, and the who are to the total equation. What could be more perfect than eating one of Milan's culinary trademarks, the risotto la milanese, in the impenetrable kitchens of the Four Seasons Hotel, prepared by one of the best chefs in Italy? In fact, to order the risotto la milanese is one foolproof way to test the mettle of an establishment and its chef. The chef in question is Sergio May. Eh, sta, padre. Buono who's been cooking risotto la milanese since 1967. The restaurant's kitchen is one of the most exciting places on earth. And we were the honored guests. It is a place of glamour, of mystery, of heat, passion and pain. It's in the kitchens of the most talented chefs that you learn the best kept secrets and snippets of kitchen wisdom. Facciamo un po' più giallo, tipo la Madonnina di Ancora Milano, va? Sì. Tu ordina e io Come la Madonnina di Milano. Esatto. Bon. Ci siamo, Se va. vuoi te la canto, le, eh. Le a posto. The preference for gold-tinted food dates back to the 14th century, when dishes from the European elite were trimmed with gold leaf. Not for ostentation, but because that costly garnish was considered a cure for all illnesses. Ah, the moment of truth. Cosa pensi? Un pizzico? Penso che l'ho fatto un po' saporito. No. No. Va bene. It's no. fine. No, no. Okay. No, it's very nice. Fine. Mm. Oh, wow. Posso aiutarti, Sergio? All you have to do is eat it. That's the only way you can help him. Not only made by the chef, but served by the chef. Please, sit down, please. How could I refuse such an order? Ah, the perfect meal. The texture is just right. Each grain of rice is separate and cooked al dente. There is a butteriness and soupiness without being either. Etched with the finest parmesan, the right amount of saffron and the depth of flavor. Now it's time to exchange the ancient show of trust and fluids. Enjoy. Well, you get to have your say and show your appreciation for the people around you. Cicola. It's a time to say something of substance. For our everlasting stories. And think far too much. You know what I think, Maurizio? I think this is just the beginning. I think there's so much more to come. And as if we hadn't had enough food and drink for one day, we thought we'd end the evening in style with friends, family, and the TV crew. Oh, you. Show the leg. Go to the food. More interesting. But the cameraman was still on my tail. Yeah, it's wine, and I'm drinking. Lots of wine. She got The women watch it. And when you least expect it, the camera crew, who you thought were your comrades, your family, even your best friends, turn against you without any warning. All in the name of Gigola. I want this my plate. Something strange might happen sometime. This is my rice anyway. He's 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 stealing my rice. 